what are some boundaries that you have set lately or that you have been meaning to set? Answer in the comments. Um, I just set a boundary this morning with somebody who was part of the perfect storm that led to a lot of my chronic illnesses. A very traumatic experience with this person. And the boundary that I set was regarding topics of conversation. There's only one topic of conversation that I feel safe discussing with this person. I have no choice. Um, I need to communicate with this person, unfortunately. And that is the only thing that makes me feel comfortable. So I expressed that to them this morning and their response was to make fun of me. I would be lying if I said I wasn't upset at all. It was a bit triggering for me when they made fun of me, but I was quickly able to realize that that says so much more about the other person than it does about you. Somebody else's behavior and response to your needs means that that's a problem that they are having, not you. And recognizing that has really made a difference in my day so far. I know that I'm worthy of setting boundaries with difficult people and with all kinds of different people. And you know what's been really great in this past year is I feel like I've actually developed much stronger relationships with many people that are important to me in my life because of expressing needs and boundaries and just like elevating, you know? <laughs> um, and all of us are worthy of that. So just remember that when you are making these decisions for yourself, it relates to brain rewiring and retraining because when your entire system feels safer, it's more opt to make those permanent changes. It's more neuroplastic and open and ready to connect those pathways permanently that you're trying to create instead of constantly having these roadblocks of, you know, <clears throat> an overly negative emotional status. Even if you don't see changes in your symptoms from doing something like setting boundaries you're still changing your brain. If your mood is elevated, you're going to have a better day. And when you have a better day, you're gonna be more optimistic about changing the things that you need to change. And you might even start to feel less symptomatic. So just, you could even make notes of some of the little tiny positive changes you've seen. I'm writing down in my journal today that I feel pretty good. And I'm not going to lie, I'm having a lot of other symptoms, but I'm just, I don't know. Like, today I'm rocking it. Like, I'm happy. And I really think that that is going to change my overall health and happiness in the long term, in the future. If we have more days like this, we're just going to feel better. So... Let me know in the comments what some of the things that you're trying to set or have set recently. Um, you know, we all have those difficult people and situations in our lives. So um, it's something that so many people can relate to. I really appreciate hearing from everybody, everybody's support, and just know that you have someone over here on your side too.